an hour, but a lot of hard work went into that one mile an hour. Yeah, I mean, a year work, you know, I mean, you, you we made a lot of changes. Uh, you know, the lake cooperated that last run. You know, conditions were pretty good. Um, probably had a couple more mile an hour in the boat, but you know, you're just never going to get them all out. Um, yeah, so it was a function of a little bit of luck, a lot of hard work, and uh, staying up top. Catamaran fundamentally, um, it's, which means it's got two sponsons. It's you know not like a V-hull. Uh, but the Mystic 50 is obviously it's 50 feet long, it's 12 feet wide. Um, in this particular configuration, we run two 3,000 horsepower turbines. Um, so we're spinning, they're actually helicopter engines, not jet engines. They, a shaft turns the propeller, uh, they burn jet fuel. Um, we make somewhere 3,000 horsepower per side on a day like today. Um, we don't actually get to all that horsepower, we get to about 90% of it in a mile. Um, so it's a rudder boat, uh, so all the steering is done with a center rudder in the middle of the tunnel, uh, which is a little bit different than a lot of the cat boats. A lot of the cat boats you see around here actually have stern drives that turn. You know, stern drives are very common on a V-hull as well. So it's, you know, it's, it's some racing technology that we're perfected. You know, we run them the same way on the pleasure boats. Um, you know, I had my son in the Mystic 50, in this Mystic 50 this morning on the way over with his friend that came up with us. You know, they were sitting in the back at 165 on the way over here. So it's a very safe and stable boat, you know, mid 160s, 170s, and obviously, you know, she can run 210 on a, you know, 209 on a race course um, under the right conditions.